fake national emergency. To build a fake wall. Fake wall. I guess maybe that is the fakest thing about this protest is now they are calling it a fake wall. Um, as far as the new refugees go, you know, who should who should they vote for in 2020? Where do you think their support should lie? <laughs> Whoever can beat Trump. <laughs> Welcome to the DCNF Live. We are actually right outside the White House here. There is a protest going on in Lafayette Square. It's sponsored by Move On. They have plenty of speakers. A group of people here that are protesting. It's President's Day, so a lot of people are off work. And so we're just going to go and ask protesters why they're actually here. This is Jason Hopkins with the DCNF. We're here in Washington, D.C. There's a protest going on over Trump's emergency declaration to build wall and gain wall funding. So we're here just talking to a few people. What do walls do? <laughs> well, they, they keep people apart. Uh, they even keep, you know, they even keep... Uh, Creatures apart that have, you know, would have, have a, a natural territory to live in. It's kind of ironic that on President's Day, a day to honor presidents, um, there's quite a few people that are out here protesting our president due to the, the national emergency that he's declaring on the border for the border wall. Um, lots of people with signs. So why are you here today? I'm here because Trump has invoked a fake emergency. And the fact is that we have real emergencies. A lot of people are against um, the border wall for obvious reasons and the national emergency. We have our support for the Saudi-led war on Yemen is a real emergency. It's the worst humanitarian crisis on earth. Hi, ma'am. Can I ask why you're protesting today? Excuse me? Can I ask why you're protesting today? Well, I'm very much against what's happening at the border, and I'm very much against the emergency order of the president. Endless U.S support for Israel's occupation is a real emergency and um, I think we should be coming up with a comprehensive immigration policy that allows the dreamers to be um, part of our society and that we need to be a welcoming group. Refugees coming to our borders thanks to decades of U.S. foreign policy is a real emergency. Now, would you trade a border wall for maybe for maybe DACA protection? For, for what kind of protection? For, for protection for dreamers? I would. I would, definitely. Homelessness in America is a real emergency. Reject Trump's fake crisis and ra racist deportations force. The lack of health care. Can I ask why you are out here protesting today? Oh, well, there is no emergency, and we need to gather around that and, and make sure that, uh, that there's justice. But building a wall to keep refugees out, building a wall that isn't even effective, is a fake emergency, and we're here to say no walls. So you, don't, you don't believe that there's any need to have maybe a border wall for our country? Really, no. I mean, there's so many other ways to, you know, to provide security, and you know, that's really the most ludicrous of all, really. 